What is up guys, Mel Pliskin here, and welcome back to some more of The Walking Dead. When we left off last time, we got into this room, or this mansion, kind of looking mansion kind of place. We finally got to Savannah, that's that's the place, right? I can't remember. And now we gotta look around and see if we can find something. We just got, we just broke into this house. Shh, don't tell that one. Probably not the best idea right now. I ought to start drinking. You need to stay frosty. Hey, you gotta stay frosty, guys. It's gonna be my new saying from now on, even though I said Looks it a couple times before. And heavy. Doubt any looters would be able to haul that thing too far. But I never really knew. I didn't really know what stay frosty was. I guess it just means like if you're drunk or something like that, you just need to stay focused or not drunk. Stay sober. That's what the word is. And I said it at school because some of my friends used to say it. And it was like stay frosty, because I was like. Hey guys. How's the house looking? I finished in a minute. Not done searching the first floor yet, but so far so good. Mm -hmm. About that boat. What do you thing. guys think about this plan of Kinney's? The guy's losing it. Look, Lee, I know he's your friend and all, but you need to be careful. That man is on the edge, and I don't know if I want to be around. When I'm he goes on over. the edge. Kinney's solid. Glory. He's just been through a lot. That's all. I hope you're right, for all our <clears throat> sakes. Got that right. Is the leg feeling How's any better? Couch treating you, Omi. Leg feeling better yet? I'm all right. I feel you. Yeah, I do. Even though my leg's not hurting, Finding like that face. This was a hell of a stroke of luck. Yeah, it was. A lot better when we know for sure it's safe. Yeah, if there's can find I'll anything that's sure going on in here. But right now it feels like just the break we needed. Maybe our luck's starting to turn around. Well, don't want to I say that. Believe that. Yeah. Really, I would. Well, don't say it too much. You might jinx yourself. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Thanks, Lee. Yep. So, like I was saying, I was at Camp Ohio. I was a camp counselor. I'm pretty sure I talked about this story before. But we had, like, these warm fuzzies. The little campers, uh, the sixth grade campers, um, they... Am I... Lee? Are you... Oh, okay. I had to press on the stairs. Can have the second floor covered? I should finish checking down here. All right. Can I bring this piece of wood with me? All right. So, um... These called warm fuzzies, and they wrote it to us. Well, Austin, we had to wrote it to a random person, and he wrote it, and uh, warm fuzzy said, "Stay frosty." That's where we Jesus. got it from. Who broom? Ha! Ah, or mop? Ha! Ah. What? What happened? It. It's nothing. Just. Uh, is it bloody no. or is it just dirty? Wow, getting scared by mops now. You're losing it, Kent, uh, Lee. Well, I don't know why I keep getting your names mixed up. I'm sorry. All right. We don't want to go back outside. We gotta finish what's going on here. Hey, dog food. Oh, for the dog. I'm not so, that hungry. Signs I need to finish checking the downstairs. Wait, if they bury the dog, how long has the dog been dead for? If they still have dog food? That's not a door. Well, technically it is. Never mind. All empty. Well, duh. Maybe people raided the house before already. Nothing. Water's off. What would you think? Why, why would you think that the water was still on? Maybe there's food in the microwave. Electricity's out. No power. Okay. His voice is like so subtle. My dog, Walter. Hey, Walter! I've been watching the Breaking Bad a lot lately. And that's funny that that name came up. Like, have you ever been like watching something and then like a convenient name came up or something like that? Out. How's it coming? Just like, oh, dude, I was just thinking about that, and then it just happened. Or Dudette, which is actually a hair on Elfin's bum, but I don't know. All right, uh, go go talk to Krista. It's going pretty well. Hey. 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 Sit tight. I'll keep checking the first floor to make sure it's safe. Okay, I just wanted to say hey, guys. I just wanted to say hey. Sorry. Thought I'd get your hopes up. All right. Holding up okay? I hope this house is safe. Have you checked all the rooms to make sure? Yes. No, but I'll take care of it. I checked all the rooms. There's only five, four rooms. Oh, wait, there's a room right there. I didn't see it. Open door. No, it looks closed to me. Oh, maybe get. Maybe they go to the same place. Let's check this door first. Oh, it's telling me to open the door. My bad. I thought it was saying that it was an open door. Is something going to pop out? Nope. Just another closet. Good thing there's no mops all in there. All clear in here. Don't want to get scared by any more mops. Just one more to check. Yes, sir. Huh. All 
I think it's cool how the music just changes. Ha! 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 A toilet. That's the last room. Looks like downstairs is secure. Watch me like somebody on the ceiling Please or something like that. <laughs> we should be okay here for a while. At least until it quiets down outside. Good. Thanks. Yep, no problem. Is he okay? Nope. Yeah, for now. But I'm really worried his leg might have gotten infected. Don't suppose you turned up any meds while you were poking around? Nah, uh, just dog food. And there's some whiskey in the back. Cool. Time to get drunk. Whoop whoop! I was just asking Clementine if she knows who the man on her radio is. It's okay, honey. You can tell us. Who is he? What does he want? Go ahead, Clem. It's okay. You're not in any trouble. It's just a friend. I don't think he wants to hurt us. What is Damn it, Clem Tide! She's getting like really mad at her. Him? You were trouble. I told Did him I was say... trying to find my parents and that they were in Savannah. He really seems nice. I think he wants to help me find them. Peoples are liars. Clementine. Honey, trust me, that's not what he wants. He Lee Oh. Uh, yes, Ben. Lee, you need to get up here now. What's wrong? It's Kenny. That doesn't sound good. Okay. Oh, he's up in the attic. Why doesn't he just come back down? Kenny said he thought he heard something up there. Went to go look. Why don't you go he's check, up Ben? There? I can't get him to come down. Stay here. This is the part where you get your gun out, Lee. Dead ass. What's, what's going to happen? What's going to happen, guys? Kenny? Are you okay? Is that a baby? Wait, I, I could have sworn Kenny. I seen a bottle in a hand. You okay, man? I could have sworn oh, I saw Jesus. something. What the hell is that? Oh, my God. Oh, okay, so it was something, but it wasn't a baby. He's probably thinking about duck. Oh, wow. Kind of looks like duck, don't he? Figured he's talking about that. It's just a kid. What the hell happened to him? Ain't nothing on him. Guess he must have been hiding out up here. Starved to death. Oh, Jesus Christ. Is that a diaper or is that underwear? I don't know if I can do it, Lee. Not, not again. I can't ask you to go through this again. Let me take care of it. Are you sure? Yes. I Doesn't. guess we'll find out. Redder you than you are. This must have been where he slept. Probably. He took care of himself this entire time. All empty. He probably died of dehydration before he starved. Damn. Most likely. Or sleep deprivation, but I highly doubt. Now you walk faster because I clicked Poor on him. kid must have tried to hide out up here until he starved to death. Oh, this could have been Clementine if I hadn't found her when I did. That's true. Stomp. What should I do? I don't want to shoot him because it will cause too much noise, but... That would be faster than stomping his head in. I'm sorry. Please be one hit. Thank you. I know, it's still, it's still kind of like, it, you chose to do it yourself, yeah. It's just, it's so emotional to him. do it yourself, too. I'll take care of it. I'll take care of everything, Kenny, you're good. Bury him by the dog. <laughs> His feet just went through Kenny's arm. <laughs> Oh 
Kenny looks so sad. I now realize they put a lot of detail into this game, I'm telling you. Seems a lot bigger than I remember. Just taking his time. Burying with his dog, Walter. I think that would be one of the most worst ways to die is starvation. Music's making it so intense. I think the reason why it's affecting Kenny so much, or <sighs> ah, I think the reason why it's affecting Lee so much is because what he said about Clementine. There she is. If he wouldn't have found her, that could have been her. It's a sad thing, really. One more time. This should be good. Holy crap! Oh my god! That scared the crap out of me. I don't know why, but it did. Hey! I wasn't really expecting someone to be there. It caught me off guard. You stay the hell away from us, you hear? I bet that's the guy who's talking to Clementine on the thing. Lee, what's going on? I, I'm telling you, I don't know why that scared me so much, but it did. Nothing. Didn't sound like nothing. What was all that shouting about? I didn't about? mean to lie. Just a stray dog sniffing around the gate. I shooed it away. Go on back in. I'm almost done here. Sounded like a lot to say to a dog. I didn't mean to lie, I swear. Kenny? I'm fine. I just. I'm fine. What's all the ruckus? Looks like he's crying. It looked like he was Apparently, crying. Apparently, Lee started having conversations with dogs. Should we be concerned? Whatever it was, sure looks like it had you spooked. We're all a little spooked. All the more reason to get down to the river to find a boat so we can get the hell out of here. I don't know if Omid's well enough to move yet. Well, he better get ready, because I'm going down to River Street right now to find a boat. And as soon as she's ready to go, we're moving out. I'm with Kenny. The sooner we get the hell out of here, the better. Well then hell, what are we waiting for? I'll go get my stuff. No, Ben, you'll only slow us down. Lee and I can go scout the river while the rest of you get ready to move out. You stay behind with Krista and Omid. Wait, can't I come? My mom and dad can't be far now. Maybe we can look for them on the way to the river. We need to focus on finding a boat right now, Clem. Like we talked about on the train, remember? Okay. Daylight's burning. Gonna go grab my gear, then we'll head out. Come on, Clem. Let's go see if I don't know if it's my headphones or the game, but their voices are echoing. So, you're just gonna leave me on the bench here? That's not how it is, Ben. I need you to stay here and keep an eye on Clementine. I can do that. Well, just so we're clear. While I'm gone, anything or anyone tries to get inside this house, you shoot them. Don't even think twice about it. Understand? I got no problem shooting walkers. Did you hear what I said? Anything or anyone? Good. 
I feel like it's going to be a big mistake. <clears throat> I'm telling you, that scared me a lot more than it should have. Are we in town now? Actually, I'll save for being in town next episode. I'm already going on as it is. So thank you guys so much for watching. Like, subscribe, comment down below what I should next. And I'll see you next time. Bye bye and stay frosty. Yes, Foxy! Foxy!